Welcome back, fellows. I'm your host, Suleiman Qureshi, and I'm going to walk you through yet another episode of Excel to Excel. Today's topic is very special. While we all know that prices of fuel are on the rise, it's very important for us to keep an eye on that and keep a track of that. And what other than Excel can help you with tracking it on a real time? And when we talk about the real time, it's about connectivity of your Excel spreadsheet with the sources from where the price of fuel is coming in. Very quickly, I'm going to connect you through that. So stay primed with me in the next few minutes and you will get to know how you can get live updates on fuel prices directly in your spreadsheet. I will move on to my browser. And in the browser, you can see I have one website that is fuelo.net. It's a Hungarian website, but pretty handy. When we look at it, it gives a visibility and tracking of Hungarian fuel prices on multiple scales. Um, the important thing is that we can also get global fuel prices out of this. So if we go on the top, there are multiple options. I can see here, I need to select the language first, the correct language, so that is English in this case. Now I can see uh, multiple options here. There are fuel prices, local and global as well. So what I will do is I will click onto the world prices that is appearing here. So click on it. And here I can see multiple um, world prices down there. So for many countries, the prices are documented there. You simply have to copy um, the link and go down into your Excel spreadsheet. Now it's very simple from here. Simply go to your data in the data you will find from web click on it and when you will click on it a pop-up menu will appear the pop-up is asking you for a web address that is what we copied from the website put it here and press ok it will take a few minutes um, and it will connect all the tables of your website with your excel if i click on this one i can see that the names of the countries and then the fuel prices on multiple different categories. I simply have to click load on it. When I click on load, I will immediately have all of the data here. Very simple and very easy. And you can see how quick it was to bring it in. I'll zoom it in. So when I pull it in, uh, it's very easy for me to get live data update for myself. This link is now connected. So whenever there will be a change on the website, this will appear on your Excel tracking as well. So you can keep a live eye on this. You can put it into one of your prime Excel copies and keep a track of that. I hope you learned something new fellows and it will help you to expand the network of your information as well. Keep exploring and keep learning. I look forward to speak to you on my next video. Till then, stay very safe and take good care of yourself. Speak to you soon. Bye-bye.